Hey, this is Dr. Fast here, and in this video, I want to talk about tire rotation and mileage warranty on tires that you buy. Now, with tire rotation, you should rotate your tires every 5,000, 6,000, or 7,000 miles, depending on what's recommended for your vehicle. So, you can look it up on your scheduled maintenance book that came with your car, or you just make it a habit to rotate, say, every 6,000 miles. And what that'll do is that it'll allow you to have even tread wear between the front tires and the rear tires. Most tire shop that you go and buy your tires from will have an installation charge that includes free tire rotation and free balancing of the tires. So if you do have that service included in your labor or installation charge when you buy your tires, definitely take advantage of that and bring your car in every say uh, 6,000 miles and get your tires rotated. Now on this 2008 Honda Odyssey, this is the second set of tires I've put on this vehicle. The first set came from the factory and this second set that you're looking at right now, uh, I bought it from uh, Discount Tires and the front tires, I'll show you right now, it's basically worn down to the wear bar. So if you look at this little notch here, this is what they call the wear bar and if you run your finger along this groove here, you'll feel that bump here and over here there's another one here and that tells you that when the tire is worn down to the wear bar, it's time to get it replaced. To have proper wear on the tire, make sure that you have the car aligned properly. The tire inflation is set properly to the right PSI, according to what this vehicle uh, specifies. And also make sure that the tire is balanced. So that will also help in the even wearing of the tire tread. Now, one thing that a lot of people don't know is about mileage warranty. Now this does not include the tire that came from the manufacturer. But if you were to go out to a tire shop and get new tires, uh, most of the major brands out there do come with a mileage warranty. And what that means is that usually you'll find the tires rated for 60,000, 65,000 or 75,000 mile warranty. So this tire you're looking at is the Yokohama Touring S. It's not a very expensive uh, tire, um, but it came with a 65,000 mile warranty. So now that's time to replace these tires. I went back to Discount Tire where I bought the tire and I mentioned to the person working there, I said, hey, can you look into uh, submitting a claim for mileage warranty? And if you don't ask for this, a lot of times they won't bring it up. So what the mileage warranty does is that it actually can help you save some money and the way it works is that they will look at how long you've had this tire how many miles you have driven on this tire so if let's say you only got uh, 35 or 40,000 miles from this tire and the mileage warranty was for 65,000 so they did some calculation and figured out how much uh, almost like a refund of the mileage I didn't get from these tires and will apply it to the next set of tires now here are a couple of things that you need to know about these type of mileage warranty. One is that I recommend you buying the tire from an authorized dealer so that the uh, claim process will be much simpler. They can handle everything. Secondly is do get your tire rotated at that same shop so they have a record of it because for them to process the claim they will have to provide proof to the tire manufacturer that these tires, all four of them, were rotated at the specific interval. Another thing is that the new tires that you'll be getting has to be the same manufacturer as the one you have. You don't have to wait for a rebate check or any type of check to come back in the mail. The discount is applied immediately when you buy the new set of tires. So right now I'm driving to the discount tire to get my new tires. And uh, I'm not sure if I mentioned this in the earlier part of the uh, video, but the mileage warranty can only be claimed if all four tires are worn down to the wear bar. So if you still have a lot of tread left on your tire, uh, typically most shops will not make the claim for you. You have to basically use it, rotate it, until you see the tread is down to the wear bar. If you have a situation where only two tires are worn to the wear bar and the other two still have a lot of tread, what they can do is put in a mileage uh, warranty claim for the two tires that is down to the wear bar. And here I am at the discount tire store. 
Now, okay, now I'm wrong. But what's your name, though? Should be okay, my name. Alright, I just got my new tires installed. I'm home now and these tires are the new ones. This is the Yokohama Avid Ascend tires. If you're looking for a set of tires, I highly recommend this one because the tread wear on this tire is extremely good and also the performance in both wet and dry is also very good. They are not the cheapest tires but they do perform very well compared to other tires out there in similar price range. One last thing I want to mention is that pay attention to any type of rebate that's available from the manufacturer. Uh, so a lot of the tires that you buy have a $60 or $70 rebate and here in front of me I have the form for the Yokohama $60 rebate. They offer this typically uh, once uh, during fall and once during spring. So take advantage of that. Fill it in and mail it in. Well, I hope you enjoy watching this video and if you have any questions leave a comment below and if you like the video please subscribe. Thank you.